Steve Diamond, under the new salary cap, the Premier League is third rate. Steve Diamond, the Worcester director of rugby, believes that the implementation of a £5 million salary cap in the Gallagher Premiership has downgraded the league to a third-rate option for the world's best players. Diamond, who officially takes over his role at the end of the season, is already masterminding the struggling club's recruitment. He is using his network of contacts to try to bring in up to six players while remaining under the salary cap, which Premiership clubs adopted to negate annual losses accentuated by the impact of the pandemic. As a result of the reduced cap, Diamond, who brought the World Cup winning Springboks Faf de Klerk and Ludde Jaeger to his former club Sale Sharks, is adamant that the Premiership cannot compete with the salaries on offer in Japan and France. He said, what used to come to the Premiership first is now coming third, with player X being sent to Japan first and then into Europe before coming to the Premiership, and that has been the downside of the salary cap. I know there are plans in place to allow the clubs to spend more money in certain areas, but until that is decided I am happy to take the challenge of operating with £5 million plus like everybody else. For a long time I wished I was like those other clubs, but now a lot of them are wishing they are like me, knowing how to deal in the marketplace. I do think, initially, it will be the case that the Premiership will not be able to attract those players. But what is the more sensible thing? to have a sustainable league with sustainable businesses for a short time or having the odd celebrity player. In the past sides like Sale, Newcastle, Worcester and London Irish have had to pay a premium for players because of their status and position in the league. The most sensible thing was the reduction of the salary cap, although this is not a time to be player. It is such an equal playing field now that those who recruit best are the sides who will be successful. If I can bring five or six players here that I am talking to at the moment, then we will have a very competitive side. In football, they call it the bounce when someone new goes in, and at Newcastle, Eddie Howe has gone in and spent God knows how many millions and they have got two or three wins, but rugby doesn't operate like that. With Worcester second from bottom, the decision to suspend relegation removes a significant pressure. Diamond, however, said that he wants it to be brought back. I might be a fool, but I wish relegation was still here because it sharpens everyone up and, of course, I would say that, because we are not on the bottom, we are not far off it.